Hey what's up guys, Alone here. So today I want to talk about what my definition of throwing games in Overwatch is because there's a lot of people who call me a thrower, my friends are thrower and all that and I never throw games. I would never intentionally try to lose a game and I want to talk about what I would define as a thrower in this video. So the first type of person I want to talk about is someone that, for example, never plays DPS. They pick DPS in the beginning of the game, they go out and they try their best. They really do try to play their best on that hero. And as soon as it doesn't work, or they themselves get asked, can you please swap off that character? It just isn't working. I am a soldier main. Can I have the soldier? Are you fine with it? And if that person feels like, yeah, I'm obviously not doing enough, I'm going to give him that hero. I have no problem with that. I do not call that throwing at all. If someone wants to try to play, for example, Hanzo on this map because he thinks it's really good, but he's never really played Hanzo before, but he just wants to give it a shot. Yeah, I'm completely fine with that. But you have to swap when it doesn't work anymore. And you have to realize that if you keep playing that hero, yeah, you might be the reason to why you lose. And I would kind of call that throwing, yes. And it's even the same thing if you are a soldier main and you go into the game and soldier is just hard countered. You cannot play soldier versus a team and you just won't switch off even though it's your main because you know that your pick will ruin the game. Not swapping off soldier is going to result most likely in a loss because you do need another type of DPSer. And I want to make it kind of clear that throwing games is, in the Blizzard terms, a bit different from what I would consider someone throwing. And I would not report someone for picking a hero they can't really play. And then they just keep playing that hero the entire time, even though they know they're getting hard countered. And I know who they are, the reason why we're losing. I would not report them, because it's not something I can report them for. What throwing, according to Blizzard terms, are is someone that just AFKs in spawn, or for example goes out and just looks down in the ground doing nothing. That is what throwing is according to Blizzard, but to me, it's someone who goes into the game not caring about anything, playing whatever hero they want, they do not care if they get countered, they do not actively try to win the game. That's the thing with Overwatch, if you get really hard countered, you need to swap. And I want to talk about my situation and the heroes I play, and I think you guys will understand what I mean at the end of it. So I currently have a mid-masters account that I main Sumetra on, and I have about 24 hours of Sumetra on that account, with my second most played hero on like 4 or 5 hours, which I think is Mercy. And then after that I have like 4 hours uh, Senyata, and then some 3 hours Lucio I think, and then some Sombra as well, I play basically whatever the team needs. But I know that I can carry the most and win the most games with Symmetra. I currently have 73% win rate, all the way to like 3700 SR from Diamond. So I'm doing pretty well. And therefore, picking Symmetra, even though it's not the best map for Symmetra, if I can perform really well, and we do really well in the game, I don't see any problem with that. Like, if we're winning the game, everything is going fine, I'm getting multiple kills, or I'm just being really helpful to the team, then yeah, that's completely fine. I see no problem with it, even though Symmetra might not be the best pick for that case. However, if we're losing the game, and I am just so getting so battered, I'm getting nothing done, and my entire team is suffering because of it. Yes, I do swap. Even though I main Symmetra, I go to Mercy, I go to Lucio, I go to whatever the team needs. I can even play a hitscan now and then, and it's going fine, you know? Maybe a hitscan McCree, even though I'm not the best with it, is going to be more effective than a Symmetra at times, because if I face a Pharah, that is really good, I just won't be able to do anything as Symmetra. And that's what I mean. If you one trick completely, just never ever swap. Yeah, you cannot get banned for it, but in my opinion, if you are not doing anything useful in the game that is making us lose, then yeah, obviously I, in my opinion, think that is throwing the game. So this is what I want you to take away from the video. Even if you see someone that has never played, for example, Hanzo or any other character in the game and they decide to pick that hero, do not rage. Chill out and give them a chance. Maybe they actually think it's a good pick at the time and they will just swap off if it doesn't work. They are not actually trying to throw the game, they're just switching to what they think will actually help you win the game. They're actually making more of a sacrifice because they play something that they've never really played before and do not really prefer to play. They just pick it because they do think that's going to win you the game. I personally do not like one tricks due to the fact that they would never swap. I would prefer someone on my team that actually tries a hero they have never played before if they are fine with swapping when it doesn't work. 
One Tricks would just never do that, and even if I main Symmetra with about 75% of my games has been playing Symmetra, I would always still swap if I need to. It just happens to be a fine pick 75% of the time. Of course, there are people who just is never in voice chat, play whatever they want, and know that they're the reason to why you're losing, and they just ignore it and does nothing to improve the situation. Those players are, according to Blizzard, not really doing anything wrong, but to me they are kind of throwing the game. But as I said, I would never report anyone for it because I know it's actually not against the rules to do that but it's just in my opinion kind of a douche move. So yeah that's going to be it for this video the bottom line is please try to just do your best to win every game that's the best way to make overwatch competitive fun but yeah if you agree or disagree with me let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next one guys take care you can click any video on the screen now if you want to see it I don't know which one I put there probably some masterpiece or something and I'll see you in the next one guys take care. <laughs> Isn't it like a song? Oh my god, I said- oh, oh, <laughs> oh my fucking god. <laughs> I, I literally wanted to, to punch him in a different direction and it's just like-